country, Yemen, by Nader al Hadi. This is Democracy Now!, democracynow.org, The War and Peace Report. I'm Amy Goodman. We turn now to the popular uprising in Yemen, where government snipers have killed dozens of protesters in recent days. A 20-year-old woman is reportedly among the dead, the first woman to be killed in the uprising. On Monday, thousands of women demonstrated in Yemen's capital, Sana'a, demanding United Nations intervention. Well, today, the U.N. Security Council is set to vote on a resolution calling on Yemen's president, Ali Abdullah Saleh, to immediately step down after 33 years in power. All five permanent members of the Security Council back the measure, which strongly condemns government violence against demonstrators. This week, the Nobel Peace Prize laureate, Yemeni activist Tawakul Karman, made a surprise visit to New York City to press for international pressure on the Saleh regime. She's rejected a proposed measure from the Gulf Cooperation Council that would grant immunity to President Saleh and his administration. But sources who have seen a draft of the U.N. resolution say it calls on Saleh to immediately sign the Council's plan. For more on the situation in Yemen, we're very pleased to be joined in studio by Tawakul Karman herself, the first Arab woman to win the Nobel Peace Prize, a 32-year-old mother of three, an outspoken journalist and Yemeni activist. She has agitated for press freedoms and staged weekly sit-ins to demand the release of political prisoners from jail for years. She founded Women Journalists Without Chains and has played a leading part in the struggle for women's rights and for democracy in Yemen. Most recently, she's led rallies in the continuing protests against the rule of President Saleh. Tawakul Karman, welcome to Democracy Now! Congratulations on your Nobel Peace Prize. Thank you very much. Congratulations for all the, all the world. I think it's, you know, it's victory of the value of human rights, of the value of anti-corruption, of the value of uh, anti-dictatorship. So uh, I don't think that I am the only one who win this uh, Nobel. It's uh, uh, value battle uh, who, who win. Yeah. The whole world wants to meet you. Tell us about yourself, how you became an activist. Um, Tell us about your family, about your work. Okay, uh, I'm sorry. I have to speak in my native uh, language because I want to be uh, specific, you know. And we want to thank you, yeah. Katabi, yeah. uh, an attorney with the Center for Constitutional Rights, who will translate yeah. for you. Yeah. Thank, thank you, Ibrahim. A legal worker. Legal worker at CCR. Okay. Um, I'm from Yemen. I came from Yemen. Yemen al Hadara. The uh, country of civilization. The Yemen that was led by two women. And it was one of the greatest countries in the world. We were um, we were led by a dictatorship regime. Uh, an uh, anti-corrupted uh, corrupt, regime. Uh, this uh, regime was founded on killing uh, others, and it's a country, a, a regime that it's, um, was uh, its main uh, agenda is spreading uh, violence among tribes so they can fight against each other. نظام انقلب على الديمقراطية التي تأسست عليها الدولة اليمنية الحديثة دولة اللي هو الجمهورية اليمنية منذ عام 1990. هناك في تدهور مريع في حقوق الإنسان في هناك ما ازدياد مضطرد في معدلات الفساد. There is a, a danger a decrease in, in, in human rights and also increase in, in, in corruption. بلدي تعاني من الجوع. My country is, um, is uh, you know, uh, has a lot of uh, poverty. من المرض. From uh, a lot of diseases. من الجهل. From ignorance. هذه الثلاث الأشياء هي التي جعلتنا نثور على هذا النظام على 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 النظام السابق في في ثورة ستة وعشرين ستة. And these are some of the reasons that led us to to lead this this uh, revolution. إحنا بدأنا نظامنا من أجل إنه نعيد لبلدنا منذ يعني منذ ألفين وخمسة وحتى قبل ألفين وخمسة 
بدأنا نظل من أجل إنه نعيد لبلدنا كرامته وحريته. We 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 started our struggle from um, uh, 2005 and maybe uh, before that and and our struggle was to regain our dignity. وكانت تحت شعار مهم كثير وهو حرية التعبير. And it was under the the main headline which is uh, freedom of speech. نظمنا كثير من الاعتصامات. We uh, organize a lot of protests. الأسبوعية. Uh, weekly protests and a place we called the the, the square of liberty كان أمام رئاسة الوزراء. He was right in front of the cabinet. المطالبة بإطلاق الصحف والمواقع الإلكترونية وحق امتلاك وسائل الإعلام. And and we were calling to we were calling on the government to allow people to have a freedom of speech and so people can own electronic magazines and online newspapers. كنا نعلم ولا زلنا نعلم. We know and we 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 knew and and know. أن حرية التعبير هي المدخل والبواب الأساسية للحقوق الديمقراطية وللإصلاحات في بلدي. That the freedom of speech is the door to democracy and justice. وكان أيضا من ضمن حرية التعبير حرية الحركة وهي حرية الاعتصامات والتظاهرات. And also part of the freedom of speech is the freedom of movement. وناظلنا من أجل هذا خلال فترة كبيرة كان إضافة إلى نضال إخواننا في الجنوب في الحركة السلم السلم الجنوبي. And thus uh, we were we were struggling and that a lot and and part of that struggle was the struggles of our brothers and sisters in the south. وكان وأصبحت ثقافة الاعتصام والتظاهر يعني uh, ثقافة موجودة uh, في 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 كل من ينشد الحرية. And and the uh, culture of 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 freedom and and protest spread it all over. لكن كلما كنا نزيد نضالنا كلما كنا نتعرض لقمع وتدهور في الحقوق والحريات ازدياد في معدلات الفساد البلد دخلت في حروب وفي صراعات لا نهاية لها. But in every time we 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 stand up for our rights, the you know the government will declare more violence against us and against our rights. هنا كانت المحطة كانت محطة ثورة تونس وهي في 15 يناير أو في 14 يناير أعطتنا الشعار ما هو الحل الذي نستطيع من خلاله أن يعني نحقق. كل ما نريد وهو أن الشعب يريد إسقاط النظام. And there was the first station. The first station was was founded in 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 Tunisia, and that gave us the title that we need to follow, which is to overthrow the regime. Yeah. You come from the same community as Salah himself. هل أتيتي من نفس المجتمع والفصيلة الذي أتى منها صالح؟ أنا من اليمن. I'm from Yemen. وعلي صالح من اليمن. And Ali Salah is from Yemen. What has given you the strength? I mean, this didn't start in February with the day of rage for you. You have been doing this, Tawakul Karman, for years. You are not only an activist, you are a woman activist in a very male-dominated society. How did you get started? Um, uh, my beliefs uh, were that men and women alike have to be in this a struggle together. And we cannot safeguard our country just with one wing. But I believe that also women can do more than that and can safeguard its, her country. And this is what uh, the, the Arab, uh, Arab Spring or Arab Revolution uh, uh, um, you know, showed. المرأة في 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 المجتمع العربي ظهرت على على غير ما كان يطرح على أن أنها مجرد ضحية. The women and the and the Arab nations were actually showed its real face. It was it was not the image that they were showing about the women and our nations. الآن المرأة قائدة. Now our women are the leaders. مش فقط قائدة في العمل السياسي هي قائدة في أصعب. يعني يعني مراحل أو مجالات العمل السياسي وهي قائدة في الثورة هي ثائرة. Not only political leaders but also leaders that lead in every single front and they are part of the main leaders of the revolution. لهذا تجديد الحكام يخافوا عندنا يخافوا من النساء. And therefore you can see that the rulers are afraid from women. Your husband was arrested first. No. You were arrested.
اثناء اثناء يعني محاولتهم اعتقالي عده مرات هي واز هراست وين اي ذي وانتد تو اريست مي ا نمبر اوف تايمز يا ذير ار ريبورتس ذات هي وود ووك ان فرونت اوف يو يس وي وير توجذر and to take the blows when you would be standing up for freedom and democracy. هو أحيانا كان يعني يمر قدامك عندما كانوا كنت تتعرضي لهذه المسائل وهو كان الدافع القوي أمامك يعني. نعم أنا محظوظة بعائلة جدا داعمة لكل ما أفعل. Yes, I'm I'm very lucky to have a family who support me in every single direction. يعني زوجي الرائع. My husband, the great husband. والدي ماي فادر والدتي ماي مذر هؤلاء اللي يعني متحملين يعني عنايه العنايه باولادي they are the ones that are taking care of my my children اخواتي اخواني my sisters my brothers انا من عائله ترى بانه على المراه ان تخوض الشان العام i am from a family that believes that women should be participating in public affairs بس هم بيخافوا علي كثير يعني. but they also are kind of afraid that i'm facing all these difficulties um, do you think the nobel peace prize will protect you هل تعتقدي ان جائزه نوبل ستدافع عنك او ستحميك؟ هي الى حد ما استطاعت حمايتي. To a certain extent it gave me some protection. لكن حقيقه اشعر بالالم كلما اشعر بهذه الحمايه. But I honestly believe uh, feeling comfortable every time when I when I when I feel it that way. بينما شعبي يعاني الان you know my people are facing difficulties ويقتل الان في الشوارع they are being killed in the streets هؤلاء الان في الرصيف منذ تسعة اشهر they are on the sidewalks for almost nine months now هؤلاء يمتلكون ما لا يقل عن 70 مليون قطعة سلاح as you know they own more than 70 million machine guns سلاحتهم الشخصية الخفيفة. This their personal weapons. غير الأسلحة الثقيلة التي يمتلكونها. And that's without counting the heavy weapons. تركوها جانبا. They left them aside. وذهبوا بصدور عارية. And they went with an open chest. استقبلوا كل بلطجة علي صالح. They received all the thugs of of Saleh. كل أنواع القتل. All the all kind of killings. بالأسلحة الثقيلة. With heavy weapons. بالRPG. With the RPGs. كل جريمتهم أنهم يمشون في الشوارع يقولون يبحثون عن الحرية والكرامة والعدالة. For the crimes which the the, the crimes that that they walked in the streets so they can they 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 asking for peace and democracy. شخصيا لا أنا لست محمية. Personally I'm not protected. لأن الشعب غير محمي. Because my people are not protected. على المجتمع الدولي أن يحميهم. And therefore the international community have to provide protection. وعلى الولايات المتحدة الأمريكية. And that and the um the United States of America as well. أن تقف بوضوح. They have to to take a clear stance. مع الشعب اليمني. With the Yemeni people. على الش أنا جئت إلى هنا. I came here. لسببين أساسيين. For two main points. جئت لأخاطب الأمم المتحدة. I came here to talk to the United Nations. بأن الشعب ينام على الرصيف منذ تسعة أشهر يستحق الحرية. To let them know that my people are being sleeping in the streets for nine months and they deserve freedom. وتخلى عن سلاح سلاحه من أجل السلم من أجل بناء دولة مدنية ديمقراطية يستحق الحرية. And they left their weapons aside so they can lead this peaceful movement so they can live in peace. وجئت لأقول لشعبنا في اليمن. And I came here to tell my people back home. وكذلك في سوريا. And also in Syria. وكل الشعوب المتطلعة للحرية. And every country that is looking toward democracy. أنكم لستم وحدكم. That you are not alone. الشعب الأمريكي الحر معكم. The people of America will be with you. أنا متأكدة من أنهم معهم. I'm sure the people of America would be with you. أنا أدعوهم، أدعو الشعب الأمريكي. I call on the American people. لكي يحضروا اعتصاماتنا أمام الأمم المتحدة. To come to our protest in front of the United Nations. للضغط. So they can. على مجلس الأمن. So they can create pressure on the Security Council. بأن لا يمنح الحصانة للقتلة. To tell them not to give immunity. 
لألا يمنح الحصانة لناهبي المال العام. So that they don't give immunity for those who who are corrupted. لأن يطبقوا قيم العدالة والحرية التي قامت من أجلها الأمم المتحدة وقام من أجلها مجلس الأمن. We want them to ensure the principles that that the UN was founded upon. نحن سنعتصم اليوم أمام الأمم المتحدة الساعة الثالثة عصرا. We will have a protest today right in front of the UN at three o'clock. American people. Must come to this square to tell Yemeni people you are not alone. To tell Syrian people you are not alone. All of us in 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 one world. نحن في عالم واحد. We are in one world. نحن أمة واحدة. We are one nation. علينا أن يجمعنا الحب والسلام. And therefore, we have we what was common in between us, what should be common among us, is is love and peace. Martin Luther King said, "I have dream." Martin Luther King says, "We have I have a dream." في شعوبنا كذلك تمتلك هذا الحلم. We have dream. And our peoples have dreams. And we will achieve those dreams. The UN Security Council is meeting today when you will be protesting outside, calling for the immediate resignation of Saleh. Why is that not enough for you? عندنا أساسين يجب أن يتم تحقيقهم يعني يجب أن يكون هناك ضغط من قبل المجتمع الدولي على علي صالح. The the international community have to create pressure on Saleh. واحد لا بد من 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 تشكيل لجنة تحقيق دولية للتحقيق في الجرائم القتل التي تحدث. One they have to establish an international commission so they can investigate the killing that is happening. اثنين يجب أن تطرح أي حصانة أو عدم مسألة الجميع تحت طائلة المسألة. Two they 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 can't provide immunity. Everyone has to be held responsible. لا بد من تجنيد أرصدتهم وأموالهم هذه التي وليست أرصدتهم هذه أموال الشعب التي تمت سرقتها من هذا الشعب منذ ثلاثة وثلاثين عام. They have to freeze their assets, and their the assets is not their assets basically. It's the people assets, the one they stole from the people. اليمن الآن منحت جائزة نوبل للسلام. Now Yemen was became the Nobel laureate. Nobel Prize laureate. مقتضيات السلامة تقول أنه يجب أن تكون هناك عدالة. The peace says that there has to be some justice. هذه العدالة إن إن ترك علي عبد الله صالح محمي وإن ترك بأمواله فلن يروا لا أمن ولا سلام لا في اليمن ولا في المنطقة العربية ولا في العالم. Without without that justice and if they leave Saleh alone, there will be no security and peace not only in Yemen and our region but also around the world. The Gulf Cooperation Council wants to give Saleh immunity. نعم هي أحد بنودها تتحدث عن ضمان لصالح. Yes, one of of the sections says that they give Salah immunity. Which is what the UN is doing. وهذا الذي. هذا مرفوض تماما. We this is not acceptable at all. Acceptable at all. مش فقط للشعب اليمني. Not only for the Yemeni people. للعالم كله. But for the international world. هذا أمر. For the international community. ترفض قيم حقوق الإنسان وقيم العدالة والديمقراطية. And and this is should be rejected by the principles of the people. قيم قيم المساءلة التي تقوم عليها نعير الحكم الرشيد. The principle that the 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 transparency and 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 justice were was founded upon. What does the killing of Muammar Gaddafi mean for the people of Yemen? It means a lot. That means dictatorships is going down and is done. And there are a lot of scenarios for the end of those dictators. It's like maybe like running away like Ben Ali did. Or to be held accountable and prosecuted just like Mubarak. Or maybe got killed just like Gaddafi. And Yemen. سيكون لنا سيناريو سيناريو الخاص بنا. In Yemen, we will have our own scenario. لكننا لن 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 نجنح أبدا نحو العنف. We will not go in the direction of violence. وأنا أناشد المجتمع الدولي بألا يجعل اليمنيين يجرحوا نحو العنف. And I ask the international community not to let Yemen to go in that direction. أي قرار لا يلزم على صالح بتسليم السلطة التي اغتصبها. If the resolution does not, you know, if the resolution does not tell Ali Saleh to transfer the power that he kidnapped. 
وكذلك يحاسب على الجرائم ويحيل ملفه الى محكمه الجنايه الدوليه also to hold him accountable for the crimes and refer him to the international criminal court اي تعامل مع علي صالح كطفل مدلل any way that dealing with Salah as their beautiful child قد يجعل قد يجعل قد يجعل بعض اليمنيين يرون في النموذج الليبي حلا it might it might make some Yemeni think that the Libyan model might be the right model for solution. And, and this is something that we don't want in a, uh, in a peaceful, uh, the youth peaceful uh, resolution. And also the, uh, uh, the, 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 the world of, of freedom doesn't want to see that. Toko Karman, what has been the effect of the U.S. drone attacks? In Yemen. I'm sure that the new Yemen, the civilized Yemen and the democratic Yemen, it will be a Yemen without terrorism, without extremism. العمق الحقيقي للأمن والسلم الدولي. And we know that we're going to be the deepest path for democracy and international for uh, for peace and international security. What has given? I know you have to leave. You're heading right right off to the UN. You have been sitting in a tent in Sana'a Square, reporting, witnessing the deaths and the injuries. What gives you the strength to do this? أنت تقعدين في مخيمة منذ شهور داخل صنعة وشفت حالات القتل والتعذيب وما الذي يعطي لك الطاقة يعني بمتابعة الحلم الذي نمتلكه The dream we have والحلم الذي بدأنا نحققه منذ أن دشنا هذه الثورة. And the the dream that we begin to achieve since we started this revolution. ونحن ونحن في هذه الثورة استطعنا أن 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 نقضي على كثير من الإشكالات والصراعات التي كان علي صالح ونظامه يزرعها بين أبناء اليمن. Since the start of this revolution, we were able to get rid of a lot of the issues and the problems that this regime created. الثارات. For example, revenge. التي كان هو يغذيها. That he was supported. مشاركة المرأة. The allowance of women to participate. الحروب التي كانت في صعد الحروب الست التي توقفت منذ أن منذ أن يعني بدأت هذه الثورة. The wars that were in Sada that that started a long time ago before this revolution. حتى الإرهاب الذي كان هو يموله. Even the the terrorism that he was supported. نحن نمتلك الحلم. We have the dream. ونمتلك الإرادة. And we have the ability. وبدأنا نحقق كثير من أهدافنا. And we started to achieve a lot of our goals. ولن نتوقف. And we will not stop here. سنبني بلدنا. We will build our country. ولا تحدثنا الآن فقط عن بلدنا اليمن. And we not only talking about Yemen here. أنا أتكلم عن كل شعب. I'm talking about every nation or every people that looking toward freedom. And the role of U.S. allies Saudi Arabia in backing Salah. ما رأيك في مسا يعني السعودية؟ كان هناك دور للسعودية. There was some role for Saudi. ولا زال. And still. ونحن نقول للسعودية بأن عليها أن تقف مع طموحات الشعب اليمني. And we told so and we 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 tell Saudi that they should stand with the Yemeni people. وأي أحد لا لن يقف مع مع طموحات شعبنا هو الخاسر. And anyone who doesn't stand with our people, they are the losers. نحن نعلم معنى الحرية. We know what it means to be free. وسنحصل عليها. And we will achieve it. والمصلحة هي مصلحة الدول هي مع الشعوب وليست مع الحكام والأنظمة التي انتهت. And the interests of countries, it's with the people and not with the regimes, because these regimes will be gone. And finally, women journalists without chains. Why you focus on the media as a form of liberation, Tawakul Karman? لأن حرية التعبير. Because the freedom of speech. وهي المنفذ الأساسي إلى جميع الحقوق الديمقراطية التي يسعى إليها الوطن يعني. It is the path to freedom and and justice that the the nation is looking toward. الآن نحن نتحدث عن محاربة الاستبداد. We are we are. أول طالبنا محاربة الاستبداد واستخدام حرية التعبير وسيلة ل لذلك. We were we were against oppression and then we and then we elevated our struggle. 
to demand our rights. We will go against all the dictators and not only Saleh and Yemen. So we can spread peace. Uh, Tawakul Karman, we want to thank you very much for being with us. She is the first Arab woman to win the Nobel Peace Prize. She will receive it in December in Oslo. She is from Yemen. That's it for the show. I'm Amy Goodman. Thanks for joining us.